I always find myself taking risk. And I think when you take a risk, you're going where nobody has gone. That's when you really can open a new path. And, and for me, I discovered this about me in science. I love taking risk in science. Being with a parent and telling them your child has a degenerative neurologic problem is the most devastating. I could not help but go home and cry about it. And I said, well, maybe if I went into the lab and learned how to do research, maybe I can at least help rather than just make a diagnosis, give news, and walk away. So I decided if I could find the genetic causes of these diseases, maybe we can do something about them. Red syndrome is a childhood neurological disorder where the girls are born healthy. They will stop learning new skills and they will lose the skills they learned. It basically affects every part of the brain. When I had my daughter, my empathy to parents of children with neurological problems multiplied. So I think that drove me to really think of ways of helping. 16 years later, from the time I saw my first Rett syndrome patient to the time we found the gene, people ask, what kept you going? I would just say, I just knew that this got to be genetic, and I'm not going to give up till I found it. And with spinal cerebellar ataxia, a degenerative disease, we learned the gene that's mutated is called ataxin-1. And what the mutation does, it makes ataxin-1 accumulates ever so slightly more in the brain cells. And just having a little bit more of the protein in the brain cell is enough to wreak havoc and cause neurodegeneration. We were able to devise a strategy to find ways to lower the protein. We discovered genes that regulate the level of the protein, and some of them you can design an inhibitor. And I feel hopeful and optimistic because I'm actually touching that almost right now. So we started applying some of the same approaches to something far more common, like Parkinson and Alzheimer, which we are currently doing in the lab. I will not retire till I find a treatment for any of those diseases that I work on. Mm -hmm.